Hello everybody! Welcome back to Delta Traveler! And today, we're gonna be, um... So, last episode, um... We, um, beat up Flowey, and now we're in Snowden. And also Noelle's here. So, let's just get into it. Hey! What the heck is that? <coughs> it's a gray door. Who the heck put a door out here? Also, my voices are probably different from the last episode. Sorry. But. It opened on its own. Maybe it's a prank? I wouldn't put it past that sand guy. It's completely dark in here. Hello? Noel? I'm losing balance. Noel! Here we go. God darn it, guys, where the heck are we now? That gray door. It led us to another world? I guess so. Wait a minute. Where's the door? Well, we had fall for a while. Guess you're right. Hey, does anyone else feel weird? Like, there's something about this place that feels really off. Now that you mentioned, I do feel a bit strange. What about you, Chris? My ring is glowing? What the heck? It is glowing. Chris? What's that glowing aura that's coming out of you? Somebody's saying, wait! Are you all cast magic here? Chris, why don't we try casting a spell and make us feel less weird? Soul sign is powered on Noel. Noel sign is laying your soul. You know, I'll cast light clear. What just happened? Everything went all white. But I don't feel weird anymore. Me neither. Chris, I think this well worked. How the heck did we get back to that forest? Maybe we find another gray door? Might as well. Not like we'll really get anywhere just standing in this cave. Come on, let's go. You and Noel, combine your powers to become familiar with the new world before you. You're filled with the power of team-based magic. Tucson Caves. Where's where's my auto run? I don't have auto run. I forgot where. It's surfbound, everybody. Ring. Chris, hello. Are you there? Thank goodness. Chris, where are for you? Are you and Susie? I want someone to dig in you two. Did you not see what happened to our car? Chris, please don't leave like that again. Anyways, please don't be out for too long. Be careful, okay, honey? Click. Wait, Chris, was that your actual mob or the one that cried? What? <laughs> Where did our found? Time to kill a plant. Well, not kill a plant. Have a friendly conversation with a plant. To the best music ever. Oh! <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Oops. Um. Okay, um. Um. Whoa, Will Sprout ran into you. It's time to have a friendly conversation with a plant. Uh, mobile sprout. Attack ten to fifty. Eight. 
Um. Mother's Rock. Attack 10, defense 8. A small watering plant in dire need of water. See, he's been on Mobile Sprout. Noel threw a little bit of river water to the Mobile Sprout. No. Mobile Sprout looks rather dry. Water. Spare. Freezing river water. Mobile Sprout. Spare the enemies. For some reason, pixel-shaped iron statues blocking the path. Oh my gosh! We're top of all this stuff on our way. Move, darn it! Nice. Susie, do you always throw things like that? Uh, it was really heavy. That wasn't what I meant, but. Pictures taken instantaneously. I'm a photographic genius if I do say so myself. <laughs> what? Okay, get ready for an instant memory. Look at the camera. Ready, say, fuzzy pickles. Wow, what a great photograph. It will always bring back the fondest of memories. And then he leaves. <laughs> Is it not gonna let us keep the picture? Maybe we'll give it to us later. Whatever. Couple of sprouts stumbled in the way. Oh wait, they're both tired, so we can just and sleep mist pacifies all enemies. Oh, fight this guy. Nice well. Tiny little UFOs, even in your sight. Courage. To a little UFO, you move slowly during your next attack. A little UFO, then shot you with a movement slowing beam. See, you just a little UFO around the battlefield. A little UFO became tired. Please move slowly. <gasps> Wait a second! Wait a second, they. S we weren't supposed to get that ability yet! Hold up! We should we shouldn't have been able to do that yet. <laughs> Little UFO. Attack twelve. Defense defense nine. This tiny space is ancient by finally landing. Anxious, sure not ancient or whatever I said. Was was that an oversight or Actually I don't have to I guess I am fighting this guy. Swinging UFO, spot him to view. Check. Spinning Robo, attack 15, defense 15. Protocol, must spin! Can't handle standing still. So you spun around until you got dizzy. No, I'll spin around like an ice skater. Spin with me! Spinning Robo is all spun out. Defend for extra gold. Mobile Sprout, that's a supposed to cohort, cohort appeared. Howard, someone can face a tree to leave you alone. Explosive book left the battle. That drags us towards it, but... Does not do anything. Wait, no, I, I don't, I can, I can just defend, defend. Sleep message, kaboom. Run away from your UFO. This guy, talk to him. I wonder who made the- Oh, come on! <laughs> Two UFOs, just route, block your way. And then S action. S action on that one. Boom! One turn! 
I'm gonna, I'm gonna remain the bridge impassable. How would someone do this? That's what I'm saying! <laughs> this game's amazing. Um, where is... Oh wait, no, it's, it's like down... The exit is like down here, right? Why is the water purple? Why is the water purple? Why is there a roll say? Eh. Mm -hmm. What the heck are you doing here? Mm -hmm. Oh, sorry about not knocking on the door before entering. Besides, you could probably use my help. And how are you going to help us exactly? I sell you useful stuff that I don't need, of course. What do you want? Shop. Hey, how can I help you? Um, so, correct. Don't really need that. Well, actually. Maybe. Hard hat? Yes. Skip sandwich. Hamburger, hamburger. I can tell you about shopping stuff. About yourself. Hey, I don't think I asked what your name was. Chris, huh? That's cool. I'm Sans. Sans Skeleton. You already knew that. Because you already knew that, I'm gonna tell you something that you don't know. In yellow. Actually, wait a sec. We only just met like 20 minutes ago. Don't you know that friendship takes time? Besides, does you have anything more important than yellow to do? About shop. Well, I found a bunch of stuff and I fell. I don't have any use for it. So hey, why not give it to someone else? Huh? Why aren't they free? You gotta pay bills somehow. Wait, <laughs> Sands is wrestling on top of the, like, box. What's a bash one? Oh yeah, the label on the bats that I found. Well, some weapons have behaved differently about us. Their names for the types. For example, see these sticks with a slash weapon. This is stuff you already know about. Noel's ring is a nice ring. It doesn't hit very well. So you can use magic in battle. And the bat is a bash weapon. That basically means it's usually pretty strong. Aiming, aiming gradually speeds up. Might be harder to use. Of course, you won't need it if you're being nice to everyone. Red cap to get. So I was wandering around the Tucson town. Some weirdo came up to me and asked where my red cap was. Then he tried to punch me and show me a ruler before he ran off. I used to say, that was weird. Oh, right, red cap kid. You get some kid that's trying to save the world. I don't like you in some aspects. <coughs> oh, gosh. Hey, I'm trying to get rid of myself. I'll sell more. <coughs> get more. Maybe if you get back to the underground, you can see if my brother wants anything. Um, maybe I'll get the crack back later. See you later. How the heck does he know my name? Cool snake, box away. Oh, oh. Spare, defend. Cool snake, attack four, defend zero. This easy enemy somehow appeared this late. You won. Don't worry, that cold snake's gonna be important in another timeline. Uh, what the heck is the deal of this place? <coughs> I know, right? Who's going around painting the trees blue? That's not what I'm worried about. Just, this place feels eerie. So, who are you lot? Uh, what's with the ghetto? You gotta paint some trees or something? Are you telling me that you're against painting the world blue? Why would you paint everything blue? It's bad for the environment and... I think you three need to be taught a thorough lesson. You wanna try me? Bring it on, punk! Blue culture sandwiches you. Yeah, Earthbound was a weird game. 
Believe cultist. Attack 20. Defense fi defense 10. True believer in happy happyism. Wants to paint the world blue. Susie, simply jock. Cultist seemed pleased. No, I'll perform some ice magic. Cultist seemed impressed. Your soul is too red. Blue cultist here is right for you. Her whole, her whole body blue. Susie, it's a blue chalk. Cold seem quite pleased. Spared. Well, after that, I might need to think about this whole blue thing. Excuse me. Beating the whole world blue? What on earth does that mean? I guess this place is for some weird cold thing. We should go look around. Earthbound was a really weird game. Excuse me, tourist. I'm collecting donations to help protect the world from contaminants. Donate whatever you can. Leave, weirdo. Then I shall be your shadow. Ah, oh, darn it. They won't, they won't walk through. This is a random kid. I guess that makes sense. <laughs> this blue, blue tile is unsettling to you, but one thing lies your mind. You're filled with the power of paint thinner. Happy, happy village. Blue, blue, do you want to be one of us? Then go meet the great Mr. Carpenter as soon as possible. Sandwich inside the box. Carrying too many items. Um, bandage. We have better. Hard hat. Give that to Susie. Wait, wait. Bandage heals 10 HP. And we are. Got the skip sandwich. Wait, we're, we're still recording, right? Okay, we are. Thank goodness. Yes, we're getting audio and everything, right? Yes, yes, you are. Okay, that's good. Um, there's no response. I guess he's not real. Or blue, blue. Don't bother us. We're in the middle of prayer. Okay, I'll move. Just hurry. Blue, blue. I'll stand somewhere else. Green, green. Oops, that's not it. I'm still new with this. That wasn't even close. Oh, just no response. Blue, blue. You strange, unmasked people. Don't go to heaven. Are we seriously gonna fight right here, right now? Uh, yeah, and I'll get two of these guys to help. Freak, I'll just block your way. Earth bound was a weird game. You leave us alone, you being us blue. I will encourage you to get hit this turn. Looks like Cole just wants to paint you. We got hit this turn. We got. Give your gold crap away from us. Susie's so encourage you to avoid getting hit this turn. <sighs> Gargus McBargus. Spoogly McBoogly. Oh my gosh. Oh, 
Okay, we only got one guy now. Okay, I don't I don't think I'm gonna be able to censor this virus. At least like in the text. So, um yeah, you might just have to like just not read it. Just forget how to read English for like two seconds and you'll be fine. Freaking area. These enemies. <sighs> Go back to the save point. <laughs> I. Is something wrong? I screamed because I didn't know what to do. Mood. Thanks for coming. I've been waiting for you, Free. I need your assistance to make the world blue and change it into a peaceful society. Will you be my right hand assistance? Heck no. Heck no, weirdo. If you don't want to be my right hand, my left would be just fine. Just kidding. Your existence is a problem to me and my religion. Defy me, and I shall end your bit of a life. Behold! Oh, it just straight up kills you! <laughs> oh, um... Wow. So I guess we do have to go do that other thing after all. Whatever it was, there's like... Is it like over here or something? It's just... How is that guy so tall? Appears to be key features. It's sealed off. It's really tight on there. How the heck are we supposed to get through? Ah! <laughs> that was a very loud scream. Abducted by a chubby kid and a masked man. They locked me here and. Wait, how long have you been here? You've just been alone all by yourself? And I didn't even give you any food? Why I got my hands on them all? Susie, shouldn't we help her first? Oh, yeah. Well, you three aren't who I was hoping would show up. Wait, if you want to help me, we'll need to get a key from. A key? No, we don't need that. Susie? Watch this! <laughs> That's right. <laughs> well, thanks! Don't imagine it. So, what now? <laughs> well done, Chris. It appears we have found an essence holder. Take a look at the souls in this room. Notice the color of your soul, as well as hers. This indicates a connection. Though, with her, it appears her connection is not strong enough. It is spread across four humans in this world. And their will to proceed is not as high as your own. Will to proceed is incredibly ominous. Considering 
However, she seems to be carrying an important object. I wonder, would she benefit your cause? And if so, would you allow her to do so? No idea. Any ideas, Chris? Chris? Is something wrong? Huh? Um, I guess for like... Until we reach a great door... I don't think Chris even believes himself. Oh, you're trying to find a great door? Well, I heard there's one nearby. It's at a place called Lilliput Steps. But Anderson is completely sealed. The only way to get past it is to blow it up. Okay, but how? Is there a bomb nearby or something? Yeah, exactly that. There's a carpenter. There's a bomb hidden away in the center of town. <laughs> okay, I was just joking. That's like, actually stupid. But if that's what we need to do, we'll just take it. That could be an issue if you go by yourselves. See, he has his lightning power. Using cast lightning, you won't be able to get it. This whole thing sounds really tough. <laughs> Well, if you could think I have a solution, I have a Franklin badge that can reflect lightning. Maybe for the time being, I could join you free. Badge aside, I know some sinking because they can help you. I don't know. Sounds kind of complicated. Bruh. Ow! I took care of my leg. Those two are pretty rough. Oh, um, maybe one of us could carry you? Really? That sounds like fun. Um, sorry, but I don't do carrying. And I mean, she was sitting in a dirty cell. And I'm not strong enough to carry anyone. Chris? Can you carry her? Yes, because of the torture, Chris. Thanks, Chris. I could have said it less rudely. I was acting nicely. <laughs> Chris knows I'm torturing them on purpose. Paula, join the party. Wow, it's so tall up here. I'd love to also ride piggyback. Well, too bad Chris is already carrying someone. Well, you're not carrying anything. Yeah, well, I don't feel like carrying anything right now. on the floor out of exaggerated laughter. <laughs> Alright, enough messing around. Let's go to that center of town place. Uh, what's going on out here? Hey, what are you losers think you're doing? You're just here to cause me trouble, aren't you? Wow, look at this brat. Uh, hey, that's one of the people that kidnapped me! Wait, what? Uh, I did. You're asking to be Master Porky. And my guy's here, Will. I'm about to kick your butt, twerp! Oh, good guy, press them! I guess this is the part where we fight. To call this urge to attack you. Um, I guess we're gonna get hit for a lot. I'm gonna get hit again. Well, that was something. Yeah. Hey, don't forget I can say it, but I know two boobs that don't hurt you, enemies, you know? Thanks for reminding us. Darn it, he got away. Why didn't you do anything, Rolsey? Am I even relevant to this story? Whatever. Let's just get going. Doobie. 
This is why you don't do drugs, kids. You will instantly disappear, like Rossi did. I can't leave, darn it. Wait, what is our PSI even? Um, life up, like, heal, and then shield. <laughs> oh my goodness, every freaking time! Oh wait, that that does way more percentage than I really remembered. Um and then we can actually beat these guys on one turn. Yes, we are. Thirty minutes in. It's time to beat the crap out of Mr. Carpenter. Like who names the kid Mr. Carpenter? P Paula, how did you? Um, maybe you best jog our cells next time. Get ready for us to beat the heck out of you. Not if you taste the power of my crash boom boom attack. Of course, a Franklin badge. Now you shall face the wrath of my blue, blue martial arts. The Franklin badge. Franklin badge reflected Mr. Carpenter's lightning. My freaking goodness. He's just pointing at his paintbrush menacingly. <laughs> oh, my freaking goodness. How could this happen to me? I played among us. Uh, no! Oh my goodness. Okay, Chris. <laughs> oh my goodness. Um, stress. Stussy. No. 
menus. Ah! <sighs> menus. What is it with the games I played recently and and beating the crap out of Colts? See, look at how off your cold is. Do you see the many, many statue behind me? Since I got the statue, I have been doing peculiar things. Please forgive me if you can. I just want to have a normal, peaceful life. I apologize to everyone. <laughs> hey, as long as you're genuine with your apology. <laughs> if you're actually sorry, you should get out the paint thinner. Hey, so we're trying to get a little bit steps. We were told you have a bomb for that. Hand it over and I'll send your apology. I'm playing that again? That sounds like a deal. Here's that bomb. It should do enough damage to break the seal. Susie got the bomb. Oh, sweet. Let's go. So, I think we might end our episode off there. So, next time on Delta Traveler, we'll get we'll get into that cave and exit uh, this place. I thought it was probably gonna be shorter than this. Um, so, see you guys next time.